Okay. This is a sapote fruit. This I received as a tip from a customer the other day. It is not a tomato. It is a sapote fruit and it's supposed to taste like chocolate pudding. And I saw online a recipe where you mix it with ice cream in a blender and you make a chocolate mousse out of this fruit. So I've never had one before. I don't know if it's going to be any good. It's very soft and that means it's ripe. I've been ripening it for like the last week since I got it. Alright, so I'm going to cut it open and we're going to see what's inside. I have no idea what this thing looks like inside. And I only have one, so... Huh? It's tough, the skin. Let's hope it's right, but like I said I only have one. It smells funny. Not bad, just weird. A little bit of a hard time with this here. Hello. Anybody who's ever actually had one of these, if you have any advice, let me know. Alright, so there's some seeds in here, so if it's any good, I guess I can plant my own. Looks like that inside. Kind of soft and yucky looking. Doesn't smell like chocolate, but it doesn't smell bad. It smells a little weird. So trying to get the seeds out. And supposedly I'm supposed to skin it, remove the seeds, stick it in a blender, and then I'll mix it with ice cream. Hope I'm not wasting the ice cream. Oh my god, these are hard to get the seeds out. I'm gonna use a fork. Fork? This thing is tough. There we go. More seeds on this side, I think that's it. Big one. Big seeds this thing has. Uh, I don't know which part I'm supposed to use, but if it was right next to the seed, some of it's a little tougher. I think I'm gonna get rid of that. Or mushier. Strange smelling fruit. These don't grow in Florida, they're from Mexico, I've heard. In Central America. But somebody planted one here in Florida. Okay, so now... that, I am going to... try to cut off the skin, I guess. Probably. At least a little more of the fruit than I should, but. Here, I'll put it on this plate. plate for now. Pieces that I think look good, although I don't really know what I'm doing here. I thought it was going to be a darker color inside. I thought it was small seeds, but I have never seen one of these before. Turn out the skin on that piece there. Check the other ones to make sure I was careful. in the top here.
I only have one and I don't want to screw it up. <laughs> I don't know if these things are ready, readily available here. I've never seen them. Another piece. Another piece. Another piece. Should be a little easier. Just... Bottom half and doesn't have that uh, center to be over with. Cut around. <laughs> Got this last piece of skin in the middle there. Since this is going in the blender, I might as well cut it into a little smaller pieces. Really strange texture. Okay, ready for the blender. The blender here. Part. Should I cover it? Yeah. light, it's not going down into the blades. smells like. It smells like a fruit, but not a very sweet one. It makes me think maybe it doesn't like, right. but who knows, this thing may taste totally different than it looks. When they said chocolate pudding, I was expecting it to be like black color too. That's another reason I'm hoping that this is right, because this is pretty new. Let's 
they said it would take about a week to write that, and it's been about a week. And it's soft, like they said it would be. I'm afraid it's gonna rot. It definitely does not smell rotten. Mm -hmm. Put it back in the blender here. Have fun blending. Anybody has any blending tips? Don't do that, that'd be a good tip. Don't do stuff like that. Sure, you need to crack it down. I can't even find it. Maybe I should have called this how not to use a blender. It's blending a little. I got an idea. Since we're gonna mix in the ice cream. Let's put some ice cream in the blender with it. Maybe that'll weigh it down. No idea what the correct proportion is for this. So let's just use a lot. Let's see how that works any better. Go. Pop back on. Anybody ever have a little more experience with a blender? Anybody have any tips? Let me know. I admit, I have no idea what I'm doing here. Smells weird. Cover it up. Let's make a mess. Who's gonna try this? <laughs> Sorry, I didn't see that. Who is that? Somebody said something? Mmm. Green ice cream. That smells very funny. Oh, I'm making a mess. I think we need to blend it some more. Maybe that's the point. There we go, look at that. Now we're blending.
chocolate and I'm blending it in a blender with ice cream. With Breyers vanilla ice cream. Okay. Say that out loud. I meant thank you, TC, for providing me with this fruit for this demonstration. Wow, this is really okay. Look at this. Look at the color of this. Mmm. Oh, if you could only smell this. All right. The moment of truth. I'm gonna put this in my mouth. I'm afraid I've eaten worse than this before though. So this is weird. I mean, it tastes like chocolate pudding, but it also tastes like something else. I don't know. So strong. Yum! <laughs> you should try this! <laughs> Alright. Time for me to go to bed. Maybe brush my teeth.